This is the ultimate goal that every leader should have is to try to create this culture of extreme ownership within your team. You got an entire team of people that are taking ownership of problems, getting problems solved, making things happen, and, and that team's gonna dominate. So how do you do that? Well, it starts with you. It starts with you. If you try to go and impose extreme ownership on everybody in your team and beat them down and say, you need to start taking ownership and you need to start taking ownership and you need to start taking ownership, what you're actually doing is, is putting all the blame on them. So, so it starts with you. You take ownership, you model this behavior, and when you take ownership of stuff, the people around you start to take ownership. And, and even if you don't reach every single person on your team, which you're never gonna do, you at least are gonna reach a handful of people on the team, and, and as you start to take ownership, they start to take ownership, and you build, you start to, this starts to become the culture on your team, even with just a handful of folks that are taking ownership of problems, getting problems solved, and making things happen. That's how it's gonna start. Now, there's a people that will listen to what Leif just says, and I, and I say the same thing. Oh, you want to develop a culture of extreme ownership? Start taking ownership, it'll spread. And then there's always someone that's sitting there thinking, well, you know, Jock and Leif are sitting up there saying, oh, if you start to take ownership, everyone will start to take ownership as well. And they're thinking, well, you don't know about Fred over here. Because Fred never wants to take ownership of anything. And, and that's true. That is true. There are going to be people in any organization that don't want to take ownership. And that that exists in a SEAL platoon. There's you got a SEAL platoon with 16 people in it. There's two or three guys that they're just trying to look to do the minimum amount of work. They don't want to be responsible for anything. They're cool with just hanging on and cruising. And you've got some other people at the high end of the curve that are wanting to take ownership of everything. And and what you'll end up with is those people that are taking ownership all the time they will just start to take ownership of everything. And the few people that don't want to take ownership, it's okay. We don't have to worry about them. They won't even impact our culture. They'll eventually just be overrun by the people that are out taking ownership and making things happen. So are you going to get 100% ownership in every human being inside your organization? No, you're not. That's not going to happen. But the people that do step up and start to take ownership, that is going to be more than enough to make this the culture inside your team.